Let's improve safety through extra low voltage. When a person comes into contact with active parts, an electric current passes through the body. This phenomenon is called electric shock, which, according to the intensity, can cause anything from a mild sensation to a fatal shock or electrocution. Electric current can be life-threatening above 25 milliamps in alternating current at 50 hertz and 50 milliamps in direct current. Experimental data indicate that the resistance of the human body is normally between 1,000 ohms and 5,000 ohms. Using Ohm's law and assuming a human body resistance of 2,000 ohms, we can calculate the maximum voltages that generate such dangerous currents in the body. Voltage less than 50 volts AC and voltage less than 120 volts DC. Looking at these figures, Using a low-voltage transformer with such voltages seems sufficient to ensure people protection. But this is not the case. The danger can come from different parts of the system. A breakdown upstream of the transformer can cause a voltage increase up to a value of several kilovolts, carrying a very high voltage to the secondary with the consequent risk of electrocution. The solution Use a device with special isolation between the primary and the secondary. The earth of the system may in certain cases have a potential which is not zero. It could reach dangerous values, generating a risk of electric shock. The solution? Don't connect the earth of the equipment, if possible, in low voltage, and separate the active parts of the different circuits. Different classes of extra low voltage according to the HD60364 standard. Felv, functional. Special insulation is not required. The loads are not isolated by grounding. Pelv, protective. Presence of a special isolation. The loads are not isolated by grounding. Selv, safety. Presence of a special isolation. The loads are not isolated by grounding. Felv, functional extra low voltage. Pelv, protective extra low voltage by adding a special isolation. Selv, safety extra low voltage by adding a special isolation and eliminating the connection between earth and the equipment. The choice of the protection is made by the consultants, except in some situations prescribed by the standards. In general, for protection against direct and indirect contacts, there is a choice. Automatic disconnection, provided for example by RCDs. Non-automatic disconnection, provided by extra low voltage systems. Where continuity of service is essential, or in applications where earth leakage can be frequent, Transformers at extra low voltage are the ideal solution. The most used class is Selv. Benefits of the power supply in circuits at Selv. Operational continuity even in case of direct or indirect contact. No protection is necessary either for direct or indirect contact. The circuit, even if not kept under control, is always safe. ABB offers a complete range of solutions for power supply in safety low voltage. In alternating current, TM and TS are suitable for discontinuous use in SELV and PELV circuits, while TSC and TMS are suitable for continuous use. TMC can be used in PELV circuits where a continuous use is needed. In direct current, EPD24 and CPD are suitable for SELV, PELV and FELV circuits. EPD24 are used where selectivity is needed, while CPD are suitable for a continuous use.